Garrosh versus hmm. Gul'dan. Warlock. Your soul shall be mine. Victory or death. I think I played this guy before a few days. Uh, played Zoo, I think. I'm not sure about the Whirlwind. It's good against Creepers, I guess. but And Imps, maybe. Uh, I'd rather have a second weapon, like a Death Spite. Ouch. It's a lot of late game stuff. Like, no loot hoarders, no taskmasters or something. I guess it might be okay to coin out a Gnomer Smith. Um, would be better if I had a Bellerage already. On the other hand, coining out an Inventor turn 3 might be better. I don't need the weapon attack now, so... Yeah. Well, maybe he changed decks. In the meantime, it's not impossible. I guess I'm playing this one nevertheless. Uh oh. <laughs> At least this board is quite resilient to hellfire. Okay, it's handlock. That's bad. It's four, five, six, seven. Oh, there is a battle rage. Oh. Would have been better to keep the whirlwind, I guess. Uh, uh -huh. What now? I hit this, it's 4, it's 8, it's 9, I could clear- no, no, that's too bad. Wait, if I go face with everything, it's 7, 18? Uh, I can't make this charge, fortunately. I definitely have to cycle from my deck. Any war songs? It's basically it. Oh, at least this dies. I have a battle range, that's also good. Uh, <clears throat> it's perfect. More cards! More cards! That's good. I didn't pay attention. How many cards is this? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Means if he hits this, it's 10. Hey, give me a minute. Which means I should get rid of something, shouldn't I? Especially because I don't have war songs right now. Getting rid of an inner age is pretty painful, but I guess I should have thought about this first. Good mortal coil hit it, but. Like this one. To make me overdraw by one. It's probably too wasteful though. Okay. Oh, so there's the war song. Um, if I hit him, he's at 18. If I play this, he's at 14. 14 is dangerous because I don't have any executes yet. Um. But 18, no. 2, 3, 4, 5 minutes on the board, 7, 11, uh, would need the inner, the, the inner age still, I guess. So. <clears throat> Let's see what we actually can do. We can hit this, I guess. Um... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So one more, it's ten. Okay, this works. Uh, 
Emperor. Okay. Dropping pretty low. That's another six. But it could work, especially with this. And if I draw my second frothing, I should win pretty easily. Uh, I still need executes though. My shield for Argus. It's not too much of a problem. But I also don't have a whirlwind. <laughs> All the important cards are hiding there. It's somewhat sad. Um. Ah. <laughs> and I only have one war song. It's exactly like execute, execute, whirlwind, whirlwind, war song, frothing, second patron. Uh, I have like half of half of the deck is really important right now. Whatever, can we go through this somehow? Five. I guess I have to dig for the second war song. Not sure if I want to execute yet. If I play this. I have two more mana. Two is pretty. Bad, I think I have to go for it though. Don't have a yeah. Second armor smith is also missing. No. Oh jeez. I'm probably dead. But I didn't get anything good from my tank and. Of course. Mm -mm. It was somewhat close, but I would have needed at least one execute. Or like a whirlwind. Then I could have charged for a lot of damage into his face. Garrosh versus Rexa. Let the hunt begin. Victory or Oof. death. This can snowball pretty quickly. I don't even know if I want to keep Death Spider in this matchup going first. If it's face, I don't have any catch-up mechanisms. What if like the Taskmaster in a rage will win fiery war eggs? Where's Fiery War X? I'll show them. Yeah. I'll show if he claps who cuts this, it will do a bunch of damage to my face. Well, there's the death spite again. Good. And I have the use to next turn. Also quite good. Fortunately, it's probably freezing trap, so that I won't be able to play this. At least I can kill every animal companion. I have bow. Oh, that's not a freezing trap, I suppose. Maybe it is. We'll find out next turn. If I play this. Freeze this. Um, then it will be two mana, and then I can re just replay it and charge again. So let's find out. Okay, it's snakes. I wonder where all these snake traps come from. 
Seems like my next turn will be Fiery War X. Because I don't have anything to play otherwise, so I'm not going to pre equip the weapon. There's not much I can draw. Basically, Thorison. Uh, if this stays around, maybe Patron. Oh, that's good. And that's okay, I suppose, given that my next turn is Boom. <laughs> if his next turn is high main, I guess I'll just take the 11 damage the next turn. Hmm. Or I could execute it, but... That's an interesting Hunter's Mark. I guess I can wait one more turn for Boom. Hmm. I can clear everything but one Hyena. And this will... What now? <laughs> At 25. I take... 8. That's okay. <laughs> Like, if I do this, this, hit the Aina, and then he plays his boom, what what am I supposed to do? Nothing. But this is 10, this is 12 damage threatening, 14, 16 even. Plus, lucky boom bot hits to his face. So, he has to do something, probably just mm -hmm. trade in here. And maybe unleash or something, I don't know. He still has two Aina, so it's not too bad for him. Okay. <laughs> Well, if he doesn't trade, then this is a much more <laughs> valuable execute target. Oh. oh was, of course, the right decision. Let's see what happens here. It was too generous with my Warzone Commander earlier. What's the worst target, I guess? Ah, uh, maybe face, but... Uh, kinda. That was good. I thought about hitting this to deny him a kill command, but if he has the three mana from kill command, he can use one of the 1-1 one -one spider links. Aww. Four, seven, nine. Where are my battle rages? Running out of resources here. All these things are beasts also. Oh. That's annoying. This is 8 damage. Maybe I should have gone face actually, with everything. I wasn't in immediate danger of dying. Ah oh, well, with the hymen on the board, it's like 12 damage over 2 turns. It's pretty close to dying then.
best best outcomes for him. He, he has to trade, definitely. Like, why wouldn't you? Still a somewhat okay position. But I, of course, would have preferred to have some battle rages in the meantime to refill my hand. I haven't drawn my two acolytes, my gnomish inventor, one of my loot hoarders, the two battle rages. Like, half of this deck is card draw that I haven't drawn yet. And that's probably a freezing trap. Huh. I don't really care about it being frozen, I suppose. Might be a second snake trap also, but nonetheless, I'll definitely hit this, so it doesn't really matter. Oh. <laughs> this triggers the freezing trap, it's probably alright. Uh, he has played both high mains. Uh, oh, seriously? A good draw. Hmm. He cannot kill both, and I want to save this for something to combo it with. Um, might have been worth using it and drawing into a bell rage to re Jesus. Okay. Seems like he's going pace anyways. Huh. So... Where's my battle rage? Ah, oh, okay. Well, whatever. I, I could... It's like... Hmm. I should probably go for the kill. It's 5 damage next turn. So I'm going down to six, um, eight. Can do three for this turn. If he kills this, it's another four, six, three. That's basically like drawing a card, right? It's not even weak to unleash, because he only has this one card. And this draws two cards, this gets another patron. This might be hit by his bow. Death does not scare me. What is... Hmm, interesting. Snake Trap and Death Lord. What happened? <laughs> okay, well I guess I get an easy execute here. This is nine. Okay, fine. Finally, a bell rage. Eight cards left. Wow. Whatever. <laughs> this was a weird game. Okay, so he plays two snake traps. Deathlord. But two. I was about to, to think, like, maybe it's feign death, but you don't want to feign death a deathlord. I'm not sure what this is supposed to be. Like, maybe anti. anti phase hunter, maybe? Like, an, maybe anti zoo hunter. Anti zoo hunter? No. Well, might make sense. That's a lot pretty good against Zoo. Snake traps are pretty good against Zoo. Hmm. I'm no Zoo. Gerash versus Rexa. Rexa hunt begin. Victory. Okay, that's interesting. Turn three. This. This. 
I think I keep it. Might be a little bit ambitious though. Ah, uh, well. Ouch. <laughs> this is my turn three, I might not have... Hmm. We'll see. I'm still learning and trying out. <clears throat> I'm not playing something at turn one is helpful. Guess playing this is okay. Like if I do this move next turn, then I can kill the spider and the spiderling. Maybe, maybe he does something like this. Then it doesn't matter too much. Also, just play this. Actually, no. this makes a lot of sense, and I don't even have to hit because I have the whirlwind. This way, I can potentially get a good frother next turn. I think I want to clear this board. Huh, and now it's possible. It's a lot of resources though. Ah, whatever. If he wants to clear this, he has to spend some resources also. I mean, that this is threatening at least 14 damage now. Probably just puts up a snake, uh, a freezing trap. But... Okay, <laughs> or an owl. This is interesting. It's probably worth a battle rage because I have the emperor go coming up. This is if I play this and hit face, it's one card. Um. Yeah, if he hits this, it's more damage here. Okay, and I have Thorsen into Warsong Patron. That's something. Double Owl? Wow. Okay. Didn't expect this to happen. Oh, well, that's aggressive. I mean, why wouldn't you kill this? Huh. Especially with a second battle rage, for example. Hmm, okay. Well, no, it still doesn't make too much sense. <laughs> um, I guess I might play around her unleash as well. So I have Death Spite, which is three, uh, which is four, which is another four. With these, it's another six. So, yeah. Oh, that's a pretty good Death Spite also. Don't think that I can. Wow, <laughs> the aggression that I can realistically die here. So if if he doesn't turn up next turn, he's at fourteen. Wow, do I have lethal by the way? Seven. This is seven. Eleven. Seven. <laughs> I wonder. It's almost lethal already. <laughs> okay, never mind. I'll play it safe though. <laughs> can play charging boom bots next turn also. Four, nine, oh. not everything. But I can't imagine that I take 18 damage now. Well I can see. He 
probably shouldn't have gone that much face. Gul'dan! Your soul shall be mine! Victory or death! Can I afford keeping an Acolyte? I think so. My thinking is if I can clear like two minions with this, it might be hard for him to actually kill this. And he would have to spend some resources of one-shotting it, and then it still cycles and heals me a little bit. <clears throat> oh, and I got a battle range. So maybe I can injure this, draw a card, draw a second card. That's pretty good. Could also play the loot harder. Then I could play something like Acolyte Whirlwind. Let's see, what happens if I play the loot harder? It might get killed by Knife Juggler, Coin, White Walker. It must be, yeah, this was, would be the, well, okay. I think that would be the worst case, and then I hit this with white collar, and then I take too much damage. But, <laughs> I think other than that, yeah. It's reasonable. I would have taken this three damage anyways, and this way I draw a card, and I can develop the Acolyte. He needs exactly power overwhelming, and then I have Fiery War X Cruel Taskmaster to kill the, the egg thing. If I do this, I still have the same play, but he is abusive. But I would cycle a lot. That's good. Right. No, I, I'll just play it plain. The potential of getting two cards out of this, but... Okay, so he had the abusive. But it's not dead yet, that's good. So if he kills this now, I could go for something like Acolyte Whirlwind. Hmm. want is a little bit scary with this one. Um. Guess that's a good enough reason to just play it this way. He can clear his stuff anyways. That might be a good idea to cycle. He has another abusive, he kills this, Power Woman kills this. <laughs> but abuse second abusive wouldn't have killed the uh Goliath, so it might have been better to whatever. Well implosion is definitely a reason. Well, it doesn't matter. I have the second War X, which is pretty decent here. Wait, why would I? <laughs> I have an execute, I guess. I would have really liked to hit this with um, the Fiery War X, but unfortunately he had the White Walker. White Collar would be a problem now. Okay. 
still good. Put this apple on your head. We're still good. We're still good. I was thinking about playing the frothing, but I not if I don't have a way to kill the second knife checker. Okay. Some armor for me. Well, this was a better bomb than my win. <clears throat> That's an interesting turn. So much can happen with these boom bones. Well, I guess I go somewhat all in. One of the better results. Eleven. He probably wants to sacrifice this. I don't really have a good way to deal with something like Amalganas. So I might want to kill it right now. That's a lot of war songs. I could just hit him for, let's see. That's 12, 15, 7. Yeah. It's Mark! Oh, he just stopped like that. Uh oh. Might be a Doom Guard now. Oh, wow. So I guess I should have just killed it, huh? <sighs> okay, let's see. Oh, this will spawn a bunch of patrons. Should be alright. Um, can I do some math here? Like hitting this for five, hit this for three, hit this for three, yeah. Spawns two patrons, right? 